Hey everyone, my name is Justin Odisho, and in this Photoshop CC tutorial, I'm going to show you how to type in the path of any shape that you want. So in order to do this, you want to be on your project or document, and you want to grab the custom shape tool. Or I suppose you could grab any of the shapes, like rectangle or circle. But in this case, I'll grab the custom shape tool, so I can show you how to type in the path of a heart. So I'll grab the heart shape. And before you click and drag anything out, you want to make sure you're highlighted on path mode. This means that it's just going to make a path. It's not going to make a shape layer or any pixels. So from here, you can click and drag out your shape in the position that you want it. I'm going to hold Alt and Shift to drag from the center and proportionally. So now you just have your path layer. No shapes or pixels involved. And next, you want to grab your type tool. Once you have your type tool active, if you hover over any part of the path, you should see your type tool transform into a cursor that allows you to type. So if I click, I can start typing along the beginning of the path. For some custom shapes, it'll automatically give you a starting point for your type to start on. So from here, the hardest part is choosing a font and a size that's still readable and kind of adding a few extra spaces here and there so that some of your words don't go in between corners and crevices where they can't be read anymore. This is where you might want to enter into the paragraph panel and play around with some of the spacing and the tracking and adjust sizes and properties until everything is nice and legible. You can also go into the paragraph panel and adjust the alignment of the text from left justified to center justified and even this justify all which evenly spreads text across the whole path which can come in handy and one of these alignment settings might be best to make your sentence legible. A lot of people ask how can I type on the outside of the path rather than the inside and sometimes if you just go to edit transform path and flip it horizontally or vertically you'll find that the path flips inside out so your text shows up on the outside. So maybe if you wanted to type on the outside, you could have flipped it before you started and then started typing so that things are still legible and don't run into each other. Now remember, you can do this with any custom shape. You can do this with any custom path. So typing in a circle, typing in a square, whatever you want. This is how you type in a path in Photoshop. If you guys enjoyed this video, definitely leave a like on it below. Hopefully you can use it in some of your own projects and check out the Photoshop tutorial playlists on my channel for more Photoshop videos and definitely subscribe to my channel to stay tuned for all new future videos. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.